The amazing thing about pedigrees is that a, a pedigree for any given trait, like lactose intolerance, will allow us to compare family relatedness with the prevalence of that trait. So here we see Kate, and she's affected because we see that her circle is filled in. We see her parents are unaffected because they're not shaded. Her brother is not affected because he's not shaded. But her maternal grandfather is affected because his square is shaded. And her paternal aunt, her dad's sister, is also shaded, also affected. The shading of these shapes in the pedigree allows us to identify the phenotype or the observable condition or trait of an individual. So in this pedigree, Kate's phenotype is lactose intolerance, whereas her brother's phenotype is lactose tolerance. So what other information do you think you could get from this pedigree here of Kate's family concerning the trait of lactose intolerance? Take a look at each of these particular options and then look at the pedigree and determine whether or not you think it's true. Check any and all boxes that you think apply. Remember, if you're affected, you're shaded in, meaning that you have lactose intolerance, and if you're not shaded in, you're unaffected, meaning you are lactose tolerant.